Well, let's dismar this for a bit. I want to squeeze in Mario and Nier as well, but we'll see how we go. There's nothing. I don't know if the trees have vanished yet. I think. Alright. I'll try and do the daily stuff as quick as I can. Do you like how this postcard smells? I dipped it in gravy, then licked the gravy off and sent it to you. Okay. read the mail that the villagers send, but that one caught my attention. <laughs> it's just... If I was a letter in real life, that would creep you out a little. It's just like... Someone's been sending you letters, you haven't been responding. And then you decide to finally read one of the letters and they're like, I dipped this in gravy for you. Do you like how it smells? I licked it off. It's a little creepy. You could make that just sound horrible. Like gravy. Maybe I should read that letters more. I bet uh, out of context, the letters sound quite creepy. I was just reading Sasha's letters. Sasha's letter said, I'm not going to read it again, but like. That. I'm just saying, if you take this out of context and put it into the context of, like, you've been receiving letters from someone and you haven't really paid attention to them. It is a little creepy. Shades. That reminds me, I gotta swap clothing. I should probably do that right away every time I start. Prison jumpsuit.
Well, cat says work up, but like. <laughs> hey, yo, this is Prison Mike. socks they have. I mean, the green socks look a little weird. No, it's fine. Be surprised. Oh, come on. It's not what I was aiming for. I was going to get bait, but I kind of forgot. circumstances that caused that all this hybrid appeared on one day and then now it's I thought it would speed up the process it hasn't really maybe I need one more of each someone thinking. Uh, 
All right, go for it. Punching bag, don't need it. Fishing boat flag, don't need it. Pocket tea, don't need it. <laughs> sure. I'll buy another do rag. I just wanted to see all the items, to be honest. I'm not even thinking about the fossil anymore. It's just... Eventually it'll turn up. The fuck? That was weird. <laughs> as soon as I stepped out the door, I went no signal. Uh ah, I didn't touch anything. Maybe I bumped a cable or something. I guess it did at a good time during a loading screen. Someone started a website that sells clothing that has the pattern of the fabric that's used in transit seats here. So depending on the capital city you live, you can get a t-shirt that has that exact same pattern on it. So you look like a, a seat. I was tempted to get one just because I have that kind of sense of humor. Hmm, you're not crafting either. So who haven't I visited?
guess that's you. What are you making? My favorite one that I've seen. Just because it's it's hysterical. Is just when they were working on the DIY recipe for the coconut, it's just like they're furiously attacking the coconut with a hammer. Halves first. This one's fake. Let me just see. I don't have to buy it because tomorrow it's going to reset anyway. Pretty sure it's fake. Yeah. Eyebrows are the other way around. I need to buy it. I don't think I've found the real version of this one yet, either. There's any item that I'm kind of after at the moment. Just the recipe, really. I'm just gonna hop in over there real quick. I just want to see what's on sale and. Get the daily recipes from here. Since I'm here. Mm. 
Oh, but it's gonna, if I go in there, I bet it's going to tell me about the hospital. Because I did, uh, well, I guess we'll see. I don't have to commit to it. Maybe. Alright, this is cool. I went into the wrong building. Okay, cool. Uh, watch table. It's ice cream. I don't know if I have that. I think I have the other one. Yeah, I'll exchange some. Just enough to buy the machine. Oh, not enough. It's nine nine. But it was like seven. That's enough. That could be another way I could free up a pattern is just using this instead of what I have. See what styles it comes in. I got what I have. Same strap type, but still. D. 
Yeah. That just frees up one more pattern slot now as well. Make it so it's just normal now. Then it doesn't look weird. I think that's the only place I used it, potentially. I don't know if I'd used it in a build. There'd be one build that could have possibly been used. I don't think I'll ever use that. This is too massive. the stuff that I don't want here. That. That. And that. Spamming the button last time I was too slow. Okay. Alright, furniture in the trees, and then just water the plants.
at least the Christmas trees are gone, so... No more seasonal recipes. I think they should start the event sooner. It's just weird that it runs a week after... More than a week. It's like January 7th and it's only disappearing now. finding these toilets. I think I have like four of them now. while I'm here. Also been thinking like what if I was to only water I guess I need to read into it, but if it's a certain number of flowers that can appear in a day, like what if I just focus on watering one set of them until I get what I want and then move on to the next set. It is less effort. Maybe it doesn't work that way. I need to get rid of this rock. It keeps growing back there.
Wait, how did I miss that one? Okay. Customize. Just so it doesn't break. We should probably do the same to the rod. You know, I'll do everything. List this lot here, and then I'm done with it. It really does take like almost an hour to do all this stuff. from the left. It's alright. It'll be a while before it gets here. everything. junk. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, uh, Daily Island. I need it to be in another season. We'll know once the second half of the song starts. If there's nothing happening in the background, it's probably not. And 64 collect them up, which they were Pikmin for. I haven't played. Don't know. I don't know. Depends what you mean by collect them ups, like one that has a lot to do or one that is fun. Some of the some of the ones from the nineties, I don't know. They had you grabbing a lot of stuff. Do I haven't played D do I haven't played DK sixty four? That one's pretty infamous for that. Banjo wasn't too bad. DK sixty four is is a lot worse. Because you have to swap characters. So every character has a set of collectibles. I've never played it, but I know what you have to do in it. The only, thing, the only thing that annoyed me about Banjo was the stupid quiz. <laughs> but that's not specific to Banjo, that's just... <sighs> a lot of games from that era. Oh yeah, give the player a quiz where they have to answer questions like, Hey, at the start of the game, there was a pair of socks on the floor, what color were they? Like, th those kind of questions. Like, I don't know, I'm not gonna... I didn't... I wasn't aware that I had to pay attention to that. The sound effects in Banjo graded you? Like, which ones? Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> Constant honking? I don't remember honking. Honking? What honked? If you want constant honking, can I recommend uh, Gex? I hear Gex is a good game if you like honking. And just the character spurting. Just like early 2000s references. The bird? That wasn't honking. I wouldn't call it honking, it was like bird noises. Squawks, chirps, warbles. I thought you were saying, like, comedic clown sounds for the honking. The next Animal Crossing guy's hunting. What do you mean? How? What? How would that even work? I'm 
just hunt the ones you don't want. <laughs> what? Okay, because I thought you were trying to, like, say, well, you have, you know, like, the chicken villages, but then you also have chickens. They're, like, different things. So there's a lot... There's... The species which are very human-like, and then there's the species that are very chicken-like. So you would hunt the chicken species, but not the chicken human thing. But you're saying you want to hunt villages that you don't want. Just talking about murder, of course you are. My mistake. It's like how Stardew used to have the option to slaughter your animals for meat at the start, and then that feature got stripped out. Damn it. I think I needed that. It becomes a very different game. That's a very dark bullet. I have I have a very dark thought. Hold on. Damn it. Give me a minute. too hard about this. Let's say there was hunting in the game and I was shooting this. It would still make that sound effect when you were done. <laughs> Just upon successful acquiring of the prey, it would still make that sound effect. That's what I, what I mean by Dark Thought. Just like, huh. What if they actually did implement it? It would probably still make this dumb sound effect. Taxidermy and mount them on the wall, jeez. Walk up to a crafting station, just all the parts flying off, and then you'd hold it up again and it'd make that sound effect. Ugh. 
It is amusing to think of. I think I'm done with this island. There was nothing special going on anyway. Oh, no, I got the recipe. It's cool. I remember. I actually got a good one. There's better odds of like just the game acknowledging meat <laughs> other than fish. Because that's the only meat you can get in game. Could just go go with the old vegetarian barbecue pork, which is actually a thing. They sell them in Asian groceries here. about something. for that like natural look just wasn't sure what it was going to involve Interesting. Okay. Huh, that's the second time that's happened. What is that? I'll look into it later. I think it's the switch box. I got a HDMI switch box, so then I just press a button to swap sources. <laughs> Is this gonna be like the USB hub thing, where I'm just replacing a damn USB hub every year? It's 
just for the convenience of not having to swap cables. What is that? Sorry if this is going to be highly repetitive. But I have fish to acquire. I wish there was another way. in the way. Okay, I was lucky that I could pick it up. Damn it, I wanted these to be decorative, but they're gonna get in the way. Alright. Well, it's a new bug, so... Shock. I've restricted how much space these uh, these clams can appear in now. and could be made interesting in this game as if they had a mini game for crafting or at least cooking kind of like what I had to do with Yakuza 
I know that's, that's such a weird sentence, but like... Honestly, the... Well, it was like a dragon, to be fair. Like, Ishim. The aspect where we ran a home. And we had farmland, and... I was growing vegetables, and then cooking. It was like the Cooking Mama kind of minigame. To make food, that was pretty good. At least then, some of the stuff wouldn't feel as repetitive. It's wild to me that they did that, just... That could have easily have been... It's own game, just... You're running... A farm. With Kiryu. And you could still have crime elements to it, like... You know, there's just competition and... Maybe someone is just... Importing bad food or something. Unravel a crime syndicate in the agriculture area. It, it could work. I mean, listen, if the last one let me be a pop star, why can't I run a farm? Sure. See, that one at least makes sense. The weirdest one was the one I got in... My first style and it was backbeat. It's like, hey, I'm gonna call you backbeat from now. It's like, what? Backbeat? Where did that come from? What does that even mean? We're gonna keep looking. Ah. Uh.
Okay. That wasn't as many pieces as you would think. Only 14 pieces. Just the Mahi Mahi is rare. Heard it. Where is it? Heard it, where is it? Okay. Alright, I have no idea. I'll just keep looking. Uh, oh, that's just annoying. Really? Okay. Oh, I still can't get it. <laughs> of all the places for it to fall. Donate the bug while I'm at it. Elephant. The horned elephant certainly lives up to its namesake. Not only does the horn on its head resemble the trunk of an elephant, it is also one of the heaviest beetles in the world. Size aside, allow me to reveal the real reason I find horned elephant beetles so repugnant. Their backs are covered in a fine coat of hair. Pursuit beetles. I mean, a lot of a lot of bugs have hairs.
while I'm crafting. Let me just make sure. So, ocean sunfish. Wait, when does it end? Hang on. Oh, don't tell me I've missed it. Give me a sec. Okay, it's until 9 p.m., so we're cool. It's like another hour. Another present in the horizon. I do have the fortune of uh, belongings today, so this is why this is happening. Cleaning set. Alright, I rounded it up to twenty. do my best. That's not going to be anything. I think the thing that throws me off the most about this is just the the time between each. It's a very the number. That was my bad. That was horrible. I think I just should go back to closing my eyes when I fish so I don't fake myself out. fish.
I think that's my third Napoleon fish, so I'll be able to get a model of it. going. I think it should be able to survive these 10 pieces. I'm gonna have to get more bait. That one was annoying. <laughs> so slow between each tap. getting the small ones. one set of bait. <laughs> I mean, I guess I got the Napoleon fish. Assuming I even need... Hang on, let's see. Oh. Apparently I only have one here. Okay, so I need one more. I might have sold the other one. Just to get more models. 
You know what? I'm just gonna be lazy. Everyone gets stored. And then when CJ's in town, I'll just sell. Keep an eye out on the shadows as well. I'm not bothering with the river yet because that one it's around all night. These ones are only around till nine. Sometimes I don't know if I'm hearing the ocean or if it's an actual balloon. I did look up at the sky a couple times there because I wasn't sure. Count as river or ocean. River, okay. Good to know.
I'll do this 20 paces a bit at a time. The tech I guess is probably the HDMI thing. If it was the capture card, it wouldn't be back up that quickly. I was looking for. Okay. Well, that's done. as well donate it while I'm here. Alright, tell us about the sunfish. The ocean sunfish is a large relative of the blowfish with an unusual shape, like a fish head with a tail. They are a fairly relaxed species, often content to ride where the currents take them. This is fortunate as otherwise the sight of a large head coming toward you might be alarming. Okay. Yeah. So that just leaves the mahi mahi. At least in terms of, hang on. Donated, donated, donated. Yeah, that's just that. Oh, hello, Blix. Sorry if I, like, mispronounced the name, but hey, welcome. Uh, how many pieces do I have? Ten? Okay, another ten. There's also fish in the river I need to get, but that one doesn't disappear, so this could be it. It is not.
Another eight more, I think. I'm just doing it 20 at a time, so then it doesn't get super repetitive. I saw one. Where was it? Not that one. There was another one. There. I was off by one. I was close, sorry. I'll, I'll settle for 19. Sorry. Now this isn't the most exciting thing to check out. I can get this other fish before it leaves for the evening. Oh wait, it doesn't leave for the evening, never mind. Still. Oh. 
I may as well wait for it. Let's try again. I've gotten one of them, so that's fine. Big shatter. No, <laughs> I don't want to talk to you. Stop. Feeling I'm gonna run out of bait again. It's only giving me little shadows. weird noises. <laughs> That's what that was last time. I heard a noise and I caught one and I wasn't sure what it was. Now I know. Big one. I mean, I might keep it just to get a model of it. Oh. Wow. That's just a sore one, but still. What size am I looking for anyway? 
Okay, so it's size five. It's not the biggest size. Got it. That's like sea bass size, which I guess that's a little deceiving. It could be this. Ah, oh, damn it. I hate it. <laughs> Too slow. Alright, well, it's not this one. This, like, the biggest size. This is something. Oh, right. But you could get these right now. slow. I guess this is going to be the annoying thing about this fish is like it shares the shadow with the sea bass. piece of bait. Wah, wah. Now I'm just storing them, and later I'll go through them. It's just easier, otherwise I'm just going to spend too much time back and forth. It's not like I need the money. Then I can just keep them in lots of three. Sorry this has become like a bit of a fishing stream, but I'm determined to get these fish. Yeah, hold on a sec. I'm curious if it's just this thing. I'm gonna unplug it. I wanna see what happens. What I get the feeling. Cause this thing is plugged into the USB hub. The flickering usually happens when it's just not getting enough power. So, what if... I plug it into a port that gives power better? <laughs> Give me a sec. Okay, let's... In one that's providing actual power. Oh yeah, see that was immediate. I think it is this thing. Okay. If it gets if it's starting to be annoying, I'll just 
I will swap. How am I going to do this without it, like, being too annoying? The fact that I just did that and it started doing it immediately, it's definitely that. It might just be the cable that's dodgy. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. I got it off Amazon. The thing seems fine, but the cable might be dodgy. It's just so I don't have to unplug things from the capture card. It's just I just press a button and it swaps sources, which is useful. How am I? I'm doing all right. Just uh, worried about a technical issue popping up right now, but we'll see if it behaves. Sorry. I was just distracted because my HDMI switcher was like flickering. I'm just paying, I'm just paying attention to it. Worst comes to worst, I just have to like plug the switch directly into the capture card. see how it goes, but it's definitely that. I might just, after the stream, swap the USB cable to some other one. It could be that it's just frayed or something. many cables that just break. <laughs> if it's broken, I'll just get like one of the ones that have nylon on them. They tend to last a lot longer. What are you thinking? Uh, no. I think I have the full outfit. Character's outfit looks funny. <laughs> I try to pick random clothing every day, so this was what was on sale. prison outfit, but then also, I guess they're going to a concert or something. I, uh, crap, that's a rare one. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna have to temporarily put away the stereo. I hate it when this happens, but... Got it. Apparently I already had it, but that's fine. I've got a model of it. Uh... Okay, good. Beach looks nice, thanks. Yeah, I'm trying to make everything look nice. Just today, I didn't feel very creative, so I'm just catching the fish for the season. Or, well, this month, not the season. Wait, what? I don't, okay. Hold on. 
and just notice this mistake here. Fix it. How did I manage that one? Uh, that one. There we go. Fixed. Yeah, that was a volleyball on the ground. Just a simple volleyball court. No, there's room. Stop it. I've had it here. There we go. Island is nice. Thank you. It's a mix of nice and messy, because I'm trying to get hybrid flowers still, so... Up this side, it's, uh... It's not so nice. But then, the rest of it's fine. Just has a couple of spots that's just full of flowers. Oh, you're here. I should do this. How many villages do I have? Uh, the 11. Whatever the maximum number is. the free furniture. Or, uh, if it's clothing. Take a break from gathering the bait. See a piece yet? Can have ten? Okay. Yeah, I think eleven counting me. That's probably the number I was thinking of. Well, they, I don't think they live here, though. They work here. They don't have a house here. the others. I feel like I've run everywhere already. They kind of run the game. They do. They make all the money. They're multi-millionaires. Hey. Three. 
three. I needed to look for. That's too slow. Where's this last one? When did I start playing? Uh, I mean, I started playing this when it came out, but then I stopped playing it, so I started playing it again this, not this year, at the end of last year. Still not used to saying 2024 yet. People wanted to see me play it again, but actually make a nice looking island. Because the first time I played it, I didn't really. It was a bit lazy. I have probably walked past this thing multiple times. It's probably hanging around the museum. But. Wait, what? Oh. Mystery swap, I mean... He kind of... <laughs> he swapped... He swapped a range hood... ...for a baby romper. Wow, okay. I f uh, yep, they suddenly ripped me off. Oops. Hey, kitchen range hood. Probably worth thousands of bells for like a piece of baby clothing. It's okay. I fell for it. It's my bad. How'd I do the profile pick thing? You just go see, uh... What's her face? The town hall. Blanking on it. Isabel, jeez, why did I blank on Isabel? I don't know why I blanked on Isabel. Okay. Manifest the yacht. Judge's bell? That's- oh, but this is like a, if I want to make a boxing ring, I think this is what that is. Yeah, okay, it is. <laughs> Put it away. Yeah, how many hours of this have I played and I blanked on Isabel? This is why I put furniture away right away, because villagers just run up to you. Uh, they either ask to buy it, 
or a swap trade, and it's always a ripoff. It's like the time I bought the sword for 90,000 bells, and then they're like, hey, can I buy this off you for 10,000 bells? No? Why? Hey, do you want to trade this? Do you want to trade this for a hat? Everyone's trying to rip me off. Ow. Finish digging up the bait. And then I gotta customize before it breaks again. Oh, I've got three min. No, wait, no, I don't. That was the other fish. Ignore me. I thought I had three minutes to catch the fish. But it's the other fish, which I already got. How many pieces of bait is that? Ten. Okay, another ten. Well, I don't want to jinx it, but the thing hasn't flickered, <laughs> so... I think I have a dodgy cable. It's either that or... Uh, I don't know. It might have been the power thing. Have to go somewhere. Alright, C1K. See you later. Wake. I'm pretty sure I have that. Uh, where was it? Wait for it. I heard it. Where is it? Did I imagine that? What? Out there. That was so weird. It didn't go off for ages. Okay, well that's 9pm. Ah, oh, I should have closed my eyes. <laughs> so much better at fishing when I close my eyes. <laughs> I 
Thought I heard it. Do I have to take steps for it to do it again? But I got the feeling I have 19 pieces of bait again. Okay. Nope, 21. Good. Alright, sorry. We're going to be a while. Going to shark. Am I still gonna be around in 45 minutes? Most likely. I might need like a pick me up or something. I got some iced tea. <laughs> I almost interpreted a, interpreted that as like, I'm going to shower. You're gonna be done with the crafting in 45 minutes, right? Like, yeah, maybe. Give me 45 minutes, I might be done with the bait crafting. I made some iced tea. I'll probably get some of that. I still want to play Mario, so... But I'm just giving this more time to see if it does the stupid cutout thing again, but I think it's behaving now. I think I should just order a bunch of braided cables, because honestly, every time I've swapped a cable, it's just been these... These ones, they have this feel to the plastic. I don't know how to describe it, but every time I get one of these cables that have this particular feel to it, they always break. Do you know what I'm talking about? There's like a particular type of cable material that it's made out of. It's like... It's not the material that the Switch cable's made out of, right? But there's... The oily... Yeah, they feel oily. That's the best way to put it, yeah. They feel oily, and they just break. Like, they just break. Every time I buy something and it has one of those cables, it's just... Without fail. And it's one of these, like, uh, that's why I was 
almost positive why it was doing that was like okay it's probably the cable Apple's braided cable that came with the new AirPods feels orgasmic. I haven't seen Apple's new braided cables, but I, all I can say is about time, because Apple cables also, like, eventually splinter as well. Oh, actually, no, on my laptop it has one. I think I know what it- if it's like the one I have on my laptop, then it's probably that. It's not just the cable, it's also the- the port, not the port, the, uh, the part at the end, the connector, would also split down the middle, like the plastic part. It'd always get this hairline crack up the middle of it. Anyway, I'll probably order a bunch of braided cables. <laughs> I'm not gonna order a USB. If I can get through 2024 without ordering a new damn USB hub, oh my god. It'll be, cr it'll be just a Christmas miracle. I'll be happy. Just every year I have to buy a new USB hub. I don't think I need one for this computer, but it's convenient because then I can have stuff on the left side of my desk and on the right side of the desk and not have everything on one end. But I don't really need the hub anymore. This is more of a convenience thing. Yeah, a lot of some braided cables. Shower time, bye. See ya. Enjoy. I might be done with my fishing by then. that sucks about this fish is you can only catch it at the pier otherwise I wouldn't need to get bait like eventually I would get it but this one specifically comes from the pier the only way to get it is with bait Now, this just reaffirms that anytime I get one of those cables, it's it's not just me. It's not me being careless. It's, it's genuinely people know about these oily-feeling cables that just break easily. And it's usually very quickly. It's like within a couple of months of you getting whatever you bought. Sea bass could be what I'm looking for. Sea bass. Ah, 
That was the fish. Ah, oh, I reacted too slow. Damn it. I reacted too slow. I think I was like half a second off getting it. Ah, this is like 1 in 40-ish odds of getting it. I reacted pretty quickly, just wasn't quick enough. That's how I know it was the fish, because Seabass has a lot of lenience. You don't have to react super quickly to get it. That one was gone immediately. Not Seabass. successful with the sharks. Ah. And one more, one more round. And again, I'm just gonna put this here. I'll deal with it later. Wait, what? <laughs> How did I not put those away?
probably going to be the hardest fish to catch. Just because of the fact that it's exclusive to the pier. That's just what makes it a pain, because I can't just catch it normally. Shadow size is the river one? Four. Uh, not sh I don't think it's this size. beetle anyway. They always go on these trees, the ones that have stuff in front of it. Shit, why? What the hell did I do? There we go.
Hold on. Uh, I hear a balloon, but also this. Make sure I'm just on top of the beetle collecting. Hey! What's going on here? Oh, it's going the other way. Got into a fight with Alice. Sure. I'll do it today. Assuming Alice is still up. Wait, where's it going? Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. What? That's not the same present, is it? Okay, I guess. Okay, I'll go put this away. A mistake. Should probably deposit the money. Wait, don't, don't drop. Uh, load and storage. There we go. over now. Why do they always turn up when I don't want them to? Okay, well at least I got to play the game. Okay. 
Okay, well, this one at least has good odds. Lower. I mean, if I'm lucky, they won't stay around for long. They're not facing the food. I use the the ATM. I can. Okay, cool. Time to go. I just noticed these. Okay. Wait, what? Still kept this. There we go. be the last set of bait I'm gonna make. Hopefully I can get the fish. Whoops. I should probably customize the shovel that it's most likely gonna break in a minute. Okay. 
Just a few more. Not even a real shock. Treasures? Selling full treasures, alright. Anything else? Pineapple or Loha shirt? I'll buy that. <laughs> I don't think I have one. a thumbnail. I don't want it to be just fishing, so this will be the thumbnail. Oh, get up, why don't you? <laughs> okay, fine. I mean, I'm sure there's like one second of that that I can turn into a thumbnail. Prepare to be bored <laughs> for like a minute. It's like a craft this. I'm hoping just this will be the last time I have to. I just need to get that fish. I don't know, I think the problem is just, even though you fish at the pier, the pier fish just, there's still a low chance.
I'm only halfway through it. This has been like 80 pieces of bait, I think. I didn't even catch the sunfish with bait, I just found it. Last one. Just figured get some whilst I walked. pieces of bait. Let's hope for the best. It's an eel.
Please, no small ones. Just... Once this fish is out of the way, I think that's the only pier fish left. And then everything else I should just be able to catch. Just without getting bait. Game. There we go. It's a sea bass. The fact that it shares a shadow with the sea bass is, I think, the most annoying part. I see the shadow. I think it's the right one. So I'm, like, focusing, trying to get it, and then it's, it's just a sea bass. go through 80 pieces of bait and not get this fish. If I don't get it today, I will amass like a large quantity of bait off stream. I'm talking like hundreds. So then we never have to sit through it again. Next time I'm just watching stuff. I'll just have the switch and then I'll just go get some bait. That's all I'll do. Distraction. Uh, yeah, I'll just go get it. Oh, that almost fell in. Tightly sea bastards. Just give me the fish. I know it's the right shadow. It's just sea bass every time.
Ow. Man, I've practically caught every fish now. I mean, that you can catch right now. Again? Down to the last ten. Getting it, am I? Uh, I did my best. It's only giving me little fish now. That's definitely not it. Man, I haven't failed the shocks at all. I can't believe it. It appeared once and I missed it. Ugh. pieces of bait to spare. Ugh, my god. Oh man, like almost 80 pieces of bait. It didn't do a strong vibration, it just felt like a sea bass, so that's why I was like, oh, it's not it. Okay, I got it. Okay, it took like two hours. I'm gonna say almost two hours. No, it took two hours. <laughs> you are actually able to wash your toes. What does that mean? Make it sound like it's a struggle. Oh, wait, because you hurt your back. I was, okay, right, I remember context, context, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I completely forgot about the back thing. Like, wait, what do, you, what do you mean you can't wash your toes? What kind of situation have you got going there? I 
call my stupid fish. Working in EMS, you appreciate things like being able to wash your. T I just got the other fish. Yeah, I mean, I've seen a little bit of it. Just assisted living situations where, like, people can't do things for themselves. That's it. That was the arowana. That's... That's it. I'm done with fish for January. <laughs> One piece of bait to spare. Already, I like to get it done at the start of the month, so then I don't have to do anything else. But it's for January, so there's still more later. I mean, this Mahi Mahi was a pain in the ass to get, but I got it. Yes, tell me about- if I spent so long getting it, tell me about the fish. The mahi-mahi is an ocean fish known for its wide, somewhat cute face. It can reach over six feet long. It is known by different names including dolphin fish, even though it has no relation to dolphins. They live only in warm, tropical waters, which perhaps explains the relaxed, happy look on their faces. And then the arowana. This beauteous arowana fetches a pretty bell, though I'd venture to say that its true price is beyond measure. The arowana is an excellent jumper. Some have seen it leaping six feet out of the water. Alas, it has also been on the endangered species list for some time. It's up to us to do all we can to help preserve such magnificent creatures for the years to come. Okay. I mean, I caught it and it's going to a museum. It's not like I caught it and it's going to get eaten. So, it is being preserved. I'm just going to be lazy and put all the fish away. And then next time CJ's in town, it's just I'll get a model done and just sell the fish I have. <laughs> One piece of bait to spare. I think I'll still amass a bunch of it, just so... Then, I guess if I'm still doing this in February, well... I'll be ready. That's a relief it's done. So how am I going with this? There's honestly not a whole lot left, like... Yeah, there's less than ten. Or about ten? Three, six, nine. Alright, about ten. Can't say the same for the bugs. That reminds me about something. I forgot this is a thing, but I need to get garbage and put it somewhere. Just to attract flies. I forget how it works, but you get a bunch of it. Make a spot for garbage.
probably up here is the best bet. I forget how much I need to drop for it to work, but I think they're only available during the day anyway. I'll try walking away from it and see what happens. I just want to catch the fly and then I'll clean it up. It's a couple of days before they spawn. Oh, wow. Well, okay. I mean, I'll, I'll trust, I'll trust that that's the case. I'll laugh if like right now they just appear. But they didn't, so. <laughs> Would have been funny if they did though. Alright, I'll leave it there for a couple days. I mean, flies exist without rubbish. You don't need trash for flies to be around. They're just around. I mean, sure, they're attracted to it, but... You're wrong. <laughs> oh, confirming. How many... How many times was, what, must we go through this? Just, I'm so trusting. Every time I'm like, oh yeah, you know what, Confirm, he probably knows, knows what's up, I'll listen, and then it's just. <laughs> Where is it? Okay, I do have that one, synth pop. I played the OG, didn't do a ton on this game, okay. It's no big deal. Sometimes you have to buzz in on the game show and take a guess. You never know when you're gonna win points. Even if you don't know the answer. I'm probably just going to go with simple panels. I don't think there's anything else that I'm really after right now. That I already have that I want more of. I'll take a look. So wait, so I can get them now? Are they, are they at least a nighttime thing? All day? Okay. Mm. I don't know if I want that. I already got one. Do I have the elusive ant? I do because I, f I found, um, <laughs> I was sad. I found a single stack of turnips behind a tree that I didn't notice from the last time I sold, so I caught it and donated it. <laughs> That's just timing. Um, sorry, I got the cable here. So I do have the ants. Yeah. 
I don't think there's really anything that I want to get more of. Oh, cash registers. Let's get some of them. Let's get a couple of these. And just, you know, I'll, I'll just get cash registers. I love how it says modern. That's not a modern cash register. That's like 1990s cash register. Modern ones just use touch screens and stuff. I mean, do I need a specific amount of trash, or is it just... Maybe I should just get as much trash as I can over there. I don't have that much more, but... May as well. You only need one, but it's on a per piece basis. Okay, well, the more I have, the better. Garbage everywhere. how there's no other way to get this but just to be messy. Alright, let me go in here. And then hopefully when I go out, it'll just be there. Okay, so like, if they ever do a remake of the OG Animal Crossing, I'll know who to ask all my questions. I'll direct all the questions. I mean, that is the rumor, like that That is what they're doing. DS and 3DS? Oh, that's not OG. I thought you meant the GameCube one. You say they don't interest you. Oh, it's fair. I mean, it has a lot of cult classics, that console. I'm surprised how much fun I had with Warrior World, to be honest. That was a much better game than Warrior Land Shake It. I gotta, I gotta look up how much Luigi's Mansion costs. Let's see if I can source a copy. I don't know, thrifting just hasn't really, well, brought much luck lately. It's... You had this plug and play game that was Animal Crossing knockoff of pandas and it was 10 times better. <laughs> Is this like the, uh,. The case of, uh, what's the, the name of that game? It's like, there's a Fall Guys knockoff that has more content than Fall Guys. I mean, they nothing wrong with knockoffs if they're fun. To some, they wouldn't know it was a knockoff. As, as much as I I laugh at, like, NES bootlegs, there are some people that would have gotten those cartridges and thought it was a real thing. Like, oh, wow, Super... My favorite game growing up was Super Mario Bros. 14. There's, there's statistically someone out there that played that game as a kid and loved it and thought that Mario 14 was Mario 14. We 
we had something like that. Before we got Game Boys, um, we had, like, this brick game thing. It came with, I think, ten different brick games. But the Tetris clone on it was pretty damn good for what it was. It's honestly entertaining enough. And I'm sure there are kids that would have gotten boot bootleg cartridges of GBA games, because that's pretty rampant. So they would have had like a bootleg copy of Pokemon or something. Or one of those like 50 games in one. Those multi packs. There are a few bootleg games if they were standalone, I would genuinely want to own, like. <laughs> The, uh, the high effort ones, like, the one that has Sonic the Hedgehog, but it's Mario, it's a Mario, or like, uh, the demake of Super Mario World, which is horrendous to play, but it's kind of impressive. Or like the Vietnamese, uh, Pokemon Yellow, oh man, that's a classic. So it's not that it's Vietnamese, it's like, it's a... The language is English, but it's like... The person ran it through a translator, from what I remember. And the English it came with was just so... amazing. It's just unhinged dialogue. Like, I think at one point it refers to the Pokemon as corn. Gee. <laughs> you know, if you hadn't have looked it up, I would have believed by now that the flies only appear after a couple days. The game you're talking about has turned into a cult classic and it costs $300. What? This Animal Crossing knockoff plug and play thing? <laughs> I'm kind of intrigued. It's 300 US, I don't know, that's like steep. Giga Pet Explorers? Oh, it's like Hasbro. Okay. Hang on. Let me see. Giga Pets Explorer. I mean, it's a handheld and you can... You can find a few that are cheaper, although the TV unit... There's one that's like a 2006 model, it's like a hundred bucks on eBay. It is expensive. 
can't say I'm not morbidly curious about it. <laughs> the controller. The controller is just something else. It's like... It just looks like one of those Mad Cats controllers that are just they're so thick and bulky and... Hey, Nick, how's it going? You remember the controller being awful? It looks awful. That's something that... Ugh, it would be funny to do, just getting some of these plug-and-play systems and playing them. Because with this... Here's, here's the hilarious thing, is I could plug them into this upscaler, because it has the... The old RCA inputs. <laughs> it would upscale them. But then, I'd, you know, I'd play each of them for maybe half an hour tops, and then I'd be like, what the hell am I going to do with them? It'd be funny for a once-off thing. That's kind of the problem, is just, well... I don't want to get stuck with them. Unless it made quality, quality content. I think if I did this, you know, this whole streaming thing seriously and was trying to do something with it. That would be an avenue. Spend it, buy it, tax deduct it, make content around it, and then throw it out. It's just like, well. Take it to one of those recycling places. So that at least it doesn't end up in a landfill. Some of them are really bad. This, uh, this one's a Hasbro one, so at least it's... I guess it's a respectable toy maker. Mind you, there have been some horrendous attempts at making consoles by some of those toy companies. I don't think I'm getting this fly. One thing that I'm looking at getting that's up and coming, there's a new uh, mod for the GameCube that'll let you... It's an optical disc emulator, so it lets you emulate the, the disc drive. Typically, you have to remove the disc drive, but this new one is like... It just goes on the side, and you don't have to solder anything. It's just... It just screws on, and you just have to plug a few ribbon cables in. And it lets you boot games off an SD card, which... lets you, uh, get backups of your games, so then your discs don't go to waste. Amongst other things. You remember wishing you were born into a Leapfrog family? <laughs> what? Leap... Leapfrog. Man, that's a name I haven't heard in a while. I mean, usually you, uh... You hear, like, Sega on Nintendo. This is like... Ah, man. We got Hasbro. But the point is, it's a, it's going to be a pretty accessible and cheap mod. And the fact that it leaves your disk drive still functional, that's it's really cool. Because, you know, there are certain games like Frogger, where you would definitely want to play a backup copy of that game and not ruin your disk, you know?
because that disc is worth uh, like $300 Australian. So definitely one wouldn't want to ruin my original copy of Frogger. I would love to play the backup instead. I think I'm gonna give up on this fly. Like, I've been doing laps and just talking crap. I was like, I'll get the fly. That's fine. This should be quick. I dumped a bunch of garbage and there's nothing here. Maybe I should just leave it and if it happens, it happens. It's like, amongst one of my daily laps, it'll, it'll do it. Okay, I'll go inside the museum one more time. If it doesn't appear, it doesn't appear. The guy just said, Red said to just do laps. I've been doing laps. Maybe you're right and the guide is wrong. I don't know. Maybe. I mean, at this point, I'm willing to believe that it does take a couple days. Yeah, it might take an hour or 15. No, that's how, the, that's how this game functions. I just spent two hours trying to catch a fish, so, you know, it tracks. But it's not like that's the only objective in the game. I and mean, you have other stuff to do. This. You don't have to be a completionist. You don't have to get everything. You can ignore the fish and the bugs. You can just go about and create a nice little town for yourself, you know? Give your villagers a nice home. You don't have to delve down this completionism route. Oh, you can have this. I was just giving this to me. Yeah, take it. Kind of a scam, but you know. The main reason is because some things are tied to real life. Yeah. I can understand that. Sometimes you do have to, uh... Make time for this game. But you can also fast forward the clock if you really can't make time for the game. That's the way around it. Just do laps. I wasn't supposed to play this for an extended amount of time and yet here I am playing it for an extended amount of time. For a fly, yeah. Well, I've spent more time doing dumber things. <laughs> Let's put it that way. It's like, it's, uh, that's fine. It's sometimes hard to believe that people watch me do these endeavors. I mean, just ask yourself this. What's the longest thing you've seen me do? Most involved, like, process that kind of... The end result wasn't really anything major. It's search for a heart piece. Which one? <laughs> Which one? Oh, multiple. Wind Waker? Oh god, the Wind Waker one was bad. The Phantom Hourglass was pretty bad too, with the fish. 
The Wind Waker one was like four hours. That was fun. Well, because I misread some instructions when I was like doing the sanity checks of, okay, I've looked everywhere, let me go through the list. And then I misread one. The one in, um, what do you call it? Uh, Minish Cap was also pretty bad with the shells. The shell farming. How's it going otherwise? I'm doing okay. Well, today is my last day before going back to work. Not sure I'm gonna be up too late. I did say I wanted to get around to near, but I'm not sure if I will. <laughs> if I'm playing Mario, well. you at that point. Uh, it's 10 30. Yeah, but you know, me. I'm just always night owl. I finished watching One Piece today, so like I'm up to date with that. It's just. I don't know when I started, but it took a while. To watch all of it. It's also your last day of vacation before going back to work. Yeah. We'll see how tomorrow goes. I did a video on, like, the retro game I played that's on the NES, the new one. That did alright, so... I'll have to play the one that I have for the Genesis at some point. Okay, I think I'm gonna drive people crazy. Right, I'm gonna do one more lap around the island. I get the feeling it's just not gonna be here. I do have some some games that are like they're n new games. They're not. They're games that have been made like past. The year 2010. But they're for all the consoles. It's kind of interesting, like, it's... There's more and more stuff like that being made. Like, there's more of an interest in these older consoles now. Just too you know what? The other thing is bugs to have, uh, like, if you don't catch them, they take up a slot in terms of how many bugs can be on the island at a certain given point, so it could also be that. I should make the others vanish. Uh, the apartment building didn't smell like beans today, so that wasn't up. Bean smell has dissipated. <laughs> Just 
just getting rid of them. Maybe I should put them somewhere isolated. Okay, final, final lap. I should be happy. I got all the, I got all the fish I wanted, so. That took some effort. I should just make this the thumbnail. Just like. Man. I need a thumbnail. <laughs> that is just fishing. What should do? Just put a bunch of trash, just like clickbait. It's like, what? What's with the garbage? It should be that way. Yeah, good enough. It's easy to tell what's happening. Time for Mario. <laughs> I tried. I did everything else though. All right. Well, if you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for sticking around till the end. Hope you enjoyed the grand fishing endeavor. <laughs> I think that's all I did. That's good. The fish are sorted for this month, so no more of that. I'll have to see the bugs. I think it's just paying attention to the beetles, but I don't have to go out of my way to look for them. All right. In the meantime, if you want to support the channel over there, easiest way to do so, just click the like button, or you can also watch me do other things by clicking one of the videos that pop up. Either way, it helps out a lot. But thank you to those that do do that. We'll see you next time.